We had a big cold front come through yesterday and it is still as it can be. A little bit of breeze out of the north. What we're going to do is try to do something a little bit different. We're going to, uh, we're going to actually, we're going to spray down here and then we've got a, a big field that a lot of deer are coming in and out of. There's a, a big oak tree with an archery stand in there. We're going to go get up in that oak tree, but we're not going to be doing a archery hunt. We're going to take the Glock Model 20 and see if we can get busy. You can take a deer, let's just say he's not such a great genetic deer, and you can give him age by just not shooting. You can give him nutrition by pouring the record rack to him, but guess what? Genetically, he doesn't have what it takes to cut the mustard, to really make the A team. Those are inferior bucks. Those are what we call management bucks. And we try to get them out of the breeding pool before they have a chance to spread those bad genetics. You may be thinking, do all deer that are genetically proven produce big deer? Well, no, not always. There's still gonna be some management deer out there. This week, we're taking some management deer. We wanna take the management deer before rut and it's fixing to get ruddy. So we really need to get in there and take these animals um, before they breed. Look at that. It's a Glock Model 20 pistol. This is a 10 millimeter. And I have, uh, I've, I've done a lot of hunting with Glocks. I, I do a lot of practicing with it since I got my CHL. I am, uh, I'm very, very comfortable shooting 50, 60 yards with it. And as you can see, it did the job. You put it in the boiler room, it'll take them out. Oh yeah, looky here, yeah baby. Oh my goodness, this is the perfect kind of deer to take. He's a great big old deer. He may not be, be big on the antler part of it, but I'll tell you what, he, big on the body. He is absolutely a beautiful animal. Look at the main beams on this guy. I mean, long sweeping main beams. I'm giving him, he's at least four. He may be five years old. And if you take a look, he's, I mean, the uh, he's broke this off, I guess. Well, it was growing, I don't know. And maybe he just recently broke it off his brow time, but this is kind of cool right here. But this is just a beautiful example of an old deer. You know, when an old deer walks out, you'll know it. I know a lot of guys will wind up saying, well, how do you know if a deer is mature? When you see one, you will know it. If there's any doubt, don't shoot if you're trying to manage. Now, uh, most people that I deal with and the people here on Four Canyons Ranch, they manage. They're very, very serious about it. They're as serious about it as I am, and I love that. They want to grow big deer. And this is a big deer, but he's not big antlered. And so what happens, I want to point out that not all deer have the, have the genetic uh, capability of growing big antlers, but you can definitely reduce the uh, the risk, if you will, as a, as a landowner, whitetail manager, by dealing with people that have great genetics in their herd. And so 
we have hunted and hunted and hunted and I mean passed up a lot of young deer that have got super genetics looking for an old deer. And if an old trophy would have come out, well, I'd have busted him, but an old management buck came out. And I took him and said, but just check this guy out. I mean, he's a heck of a deer. So if y'all want more information on, on genetics, on improving genetics on the herd at your place, wherever it is. And the cool thing about dealing with Four Canyons Ranch is they can actually ship deer from their deer breeding facility anywhere in the United States and they'll handle the permits and everything else. Just all you need to do is log on to my website. We've got a direct uh, link over to Four Canyons. But this right here is an awesome deer. And uh, in a couple of weeks, and it's hot now, but in a couple of weeks, uh, we got a couple of guys coming over here. We're going to be videotaping and uh, hopefully they'll be able to get some big old deer too. But uh, this is a nice treat, especially taking it with my Glock. The High Road with Keith Warren is brought to you in part by Reconnaissance Game Cameras, Savage Arms, Keith Warren's Texas Hidden Springs Ranch, the best value in Texas trophy deer hunting, Grizzly Cartridge Company, and Jardin Consumer Solutions, makers of the Game Saver. <laughs>